asking all of you today i will tell you how to dictate outliers and then remove that outliers from the data set okay so one of the comments came today was how to remove the outliers so i will tell you that so what is an outlier i had taken this before but i am taking this exclusively for outliers so outlier is a value on observation that is distant from other observations that is to say a data point that differs that differs significantly from other data points so if we remove the outliers then correlation coefficient may become better or slope may become better so that's it so that's the use of finding outliers and then removing that outlier so suppose you are seeing a row with human weighing 786 kg so that is a wrong value we know that no human will weigh 786 kg that would have been 78.6 or something so how to find this and then how to remove that outlier i will tell you that so first we will load ggplot2 and i am using mpg database okay that is uh, regarding the mileage per gallon in the highway that that database we are we are loading the database to variable dat okay and then it has got a column with swy okay i am going to show the summary of that particular variable <coughs> sorry or that column so it has got a minimum value of 12 and first quartile is 18 median 24 mean 23.44 third quartile 27 and maximum value is 44 <coughs> sorry so i will plot the histogram using the hist command and you can see there are some values around 40 between 40 and 45 and you can plot the same histogram using <coughs> ggplot command so this is using the ggplot command and again you can see the box plot okay so these are the outliers <coughs> sorry <coughs> sorry these are the outliers <coughs> you get while drawing the box plot and same thing we can use the ggplot and do the box plot so this is a box plot using ggplot and how you can find the outlier is the first quartile minus 1.5 iqr in the quartile range and the third quartile plus 1.5 into iqr so when the value is below this value and above this value you consider that as outliers okay so i will show you how to find that so there is a command so box plot stats shows the stats okay so you can this is a function so you can use this function box plot dot stats to find the outliers okay you can directly find the outliers here okay it shows the outliers 44 244 and 141 these are the outliers so there is a which function using that you can find the row of that particular outlier values so here i am copying this value to out variable and then i am using that out variable in the which command to find out the rows corresponding to that outliers okay okay these are the row numbers 213 222 and 2 2 okay and now we can extract that rows from the dat data frame okay so you can see this this is the these are the three rows corresponding to outliers and row numbers 213 2 2 2 and 223 so these are three rows and you can use the box plot and then the box plot will display the outliers you can see that okay and then 
when you execute the mtus command it will write above the box plot which are the outlets now i am going to find the lower bound okay usually the percentile value is 0 0.025 lower and 0 0.975 upper so below and above these two values you can have the outlets okay so what is the lower bound here lower bound is 14 upper bound corresponding to 0.975 percentile is 35.175 okay so now using this percentile 0 0.025 and 0 0.975 let us see which are which all values are outlets okay so these are the rows okay corresponding to the outlets with the percentile values 0 0.025 what was the lower bound lower bound was 14 and upper bound was 35.175 so below and above these two values this many rows are there okay this many rows okay and then you can extract the column with the name SWY that's what we are dealing with okay miles per gallon in the highway so these are the values corresponding to that column so what are the below 14 and below 14 and above 35.175 so these are the values okay so these are the outlays according to percentile 0 0.025 and 0.975 percentile we are getting these values okay these values so so these are the 11 rows corresponding to that percentile outlays so now you can set the percentile to 1999 okay you can see let us see what we will get 0 0.01 and 0 0.99 let us see what we are getting okay so we are getting the same what we got from the box plot so if we set to 0 0.01 and 0 0.99 we get the box plot results okay and there is a command for subset okay subset command using that you can create a subset from the main set okay so here this command tells all the rows where SWI column has value not equal to 44 okay so it tells 222 rows okay two outlays with 44 except that if you remove that you will get 222 rows this is one way of removing the outlays using the subset command so here i will show you how to use the subset command directly there is a command iqr which tells the interquartile range directly okay in our data set so iqr value is 9 you can use that iqr value to find the iqr to find the outlays that is the third quartile plus 1.5 into iqr this gives the upper range and lower range is first quartile minus 1.5 into iqr okay so let us find the up and low value okay so up, up value is 40.5 and low value is 4.5 so let us use the subset command and eliminate the values below low and above up okay we are using the subset command so you you got a subset in elim eliminated okay so let us see what is in the eliminated it will have 221 rows okay three rows removed corresponding to 44 two rows with 44 and one row with 41 okay the total 224 rows was there okay so i mean sorry it had 231 rows okay in addition to this one 
221 rows. So 231 rows are there. From 234 was our data set. So minus 3. So 231 data set. We removed 2 rows with 44 and 1 row with 41. So you get 231 rows. We had 234, but when we removed outliers with percentile 0 0.01 and 0 0.99. Okay, when you remove that, you get three, ro three rows removed. I hope you understood. So this is how you remove outliers. So just a recap, when you got a data, <coughs> find the IQR, then use this up and lower values to find the upper range and lower range and then find the outliers remove that outliers okay this is using the subset command this is how you remove outliers from the data set i hope you understood thank you very much